about 13 miles from downtown Atlanta. Welcome to Truist Park. The show brings you the opener of a big four-game weekend set. It's the Milwaukee Brewers going up against the Atlanta Braves. And we'll be back with the first pitch right after this. Gerald Raymond getting ready to hit. What a season it's been for him. He has supplied a lot of power and that average. Ground ball up the middle, and that one finds its way through. And they'll score first. It's one zip. Well, tack one more game onto his hitting streak, Boob. Every day, this guy just keeps making his record harder and harder to reach. I still can't believe what he's doing. Yeah, neither can I. It's like he's playing on beginner mode out there. Spencer Torkelson next up for the Braves. Batting fifth, the first baseman, Spencer. Runner on the go. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. Good job at damage control right there. So they pick up a run on two hits. No errors and a man left. And to the first from Truist Park. It's the Braves one and the Brewers nothing. Bottom four. Now the Atlanta cleanup hitter, Gerald Raymond. This is a true five-tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but when he's on the field, you can't take your eye off of him. Williamson back to work. Slice the other way. That's a base hit. Now he turns and heads for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. Henderson with a relay throw. He's in there. All over that one right there. I love the hustle out of the box, man. He drove that baseball and he was thinking triple right away. Spencer Torkelson next up for the Braves. Now batting, first baseman. There's a 1 1. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Fans come to the ballpark to watch him play. And in baseball, to have such a talented player going out there every day and putting on the show that he does, just a joy to watch. And the next pitch is way outside. Righty delivers. This one in the air center field. Brings it in with a nice running grab. Runner tagging from third. The throw is offline and he's in to score. And they lead by two. Well, that's a quality at bat right there. You know the situation. You need something in the air and deep enough. Now in for the Braves, Gerald Raymond. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership that he shows on and off the field. That one hammered left field. That's back. Bangs off the wall. The throw is wild, and it gets away. It's a double. Third hit of the night for him. And here's the first baseman, Spencer Torkelson. The pitch. He's trying for third. Pitch is high. Throw safe. I think he surprised everyone in the ballpark, and especially the pitcher. It wasn't a great lead there, but when he took off, I think he caught him off guard. Nice job to get to third. Two outs and one in scoring position. That misses, and that's ball three. Hey, get your pitch and drive it. And the right hander deals. He swings and fouls one off. A little tardy on that fastball. He's going to have to get it going a little quicker, get that front foot down. 
kick. Sandios stays alive. Raymond on third with two out. Hey, come on now. Base hit and a run comes in. It's not often someone hits a baseball this hard. It's worthy of the stat cast treatment, Singy. Well, I was anxious to see what that exit velo would be, and wow, a hundred. New inning getting started. Here's Chavis now. Hey, we got no outs. The center fielder. Ready. Chavis. And the pitch. Bounce to the left side. Oh, wow. nice play. Gathers and throws, and that's a great play for the out. Wow, Singy, he showed off great reaction time and arm strength on that play. We need to take another look at it. Yeah, no doubt, Boog. I mean, the stat cast numbers are absolutely impressive, but that's one of those plays I appreciate more with the naked eye. The reflexes, top notch. And Here's a speed threat, Gerald Raymond. Oh, yeah, Boog. He's on the brink of one of your favorite milestones. He's completed three legs of the cycle. I love me some cycle. Lined into right. This looks like extra bases. So now to the plate for Atlanta. Spencer Torkelson for the fourth time tonight. Here's a 1-1. First offering. Runner goes. Pitch misses. Throw to second and great jump. Two outs is a great time to try to steal second, especially when you have a guy with some wheels on first. Defense probably knew it was coming, but figured we better focus on trying to get this hitter out. And the righty deals. Rudder goes again. Throw to third. Save. Rudder at third. Two away. Looking good. No one better up there. Here we go. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. One left for Atlanta as the lead remains 3 1. One down. Tom Hale now at the plate. The wind and the pitch. And a pop-up on the left side of the infield. Rocchio under it. Falls it in for the out. The batter. The third baseman. Well, when you reel off eight wins in a row, you're this close to double digits, and now all of a sudden it's a challenge within a challenge to get two more wins to get to 10. But there's definitely a high level of confidence that these guys are playing at right now, and that's one of those things. You don't want to rock the boat. You don't want to disturb things. Make sure the clubhouse guy is giving you the same good food he's been giving you all along, and you can keep this win streak going. 